And a little more than a week, a national hotline for mental health will launch aimed at helping people readily get the help they need. Denver 7 CB Cotton reports our state has been preparing for months. Me, I lost that purpose. Everybody counted on me. Life stories like these are similar to what these call takers hear on a daily basis. And now, here at Rocky Mountain Crisis Partners, Clinical Director Sherry Skelding says there's more people answering the phone than ever before. Hiring um, many new team members on our front lines, which are individuals who are answering our crisis line and our support line in preparation for 988. 988, a new nationwide number that's launching in under two weeks. The number will connect Americans in crisis with suicide prevention and mental health counselors. Three-digit numbers aren't something that just exists. It's something that has to be created and the entire nation and all of our telecom companies have to be on board and it has to be made. So the fact that this is happening just for accessibility alone is a big deal. Rocky Mountain Crisis Partners already provides 24 seven crisis support through the state's existing line for mental health services. But in 2020, bipartisan legislation in the US Congress mandated the launch of 988 by this summer. Skelding says they've bolstered their team to support the new hotline. We've added um, well over probably about 60 people to our team so far and we're not done yet. Come July 16th, any Anyone with a Colorado area code who calls 988 can be routed to a crisis counselor from Rocky Mountain Crisis Partners. If you're not calling from a phone that has a Colorado area code, you won't necessarily come to our center. You'll be routed to the center whose, um, whose phone number you're, you're closest to. Every Coloradan who calls will be connected with appropriate resources and follow up care can be arranged. Skelding says 988 represents a chance for people to find solutions in their own story. You know, a lot of our callers are calling us on some of the worst days of their lives. What's closely underlines that then is uh, a national recognition of the need and to really try to normalize conversations around 988 and behavioral health crises. CB Cotton, Denver 7.